So why is it that Neo allowing himself to be killed saved the world? The answer to this is on a few different levels. Symbolically, it represents him 100% giving up his material, his temporal, his temporary, his physical ego, his illusory ego. So he's completely giving up his own selfishness for the greater good out of the pure intention of love, with true intention, not with any ulterior motive, but just out of love, out of caring, out of appreciation, out of gratitude. So whenever you sacrifice your own ego out of love, When you sacrifice your own selfishness, it helps save the world. It can help save the world if it is done in a grounded, rational way. You know, for example, obviously killing yourself is not going to save the world. So, and that's not what he did, allowing his, this is symbolic. Though, you could also take it, perhaps, to a physical level, which is that Neo, as a person, as an ego, is still an ego because it, he exists. If you exist, you are, you, you are engulfed in this temporary ego. So, in a sense, you see yourself as separate from the whole. Neo is someone that is most aware that he is not separate, but still, he has a body, he has an ego, he has a sense of identity that is separate from the whole on some level, and he represents pure goodness, pure light, he represents light, the light of love, the light of truth, the light of the highest logic and the highest rationality and the purest intention. That is his energy. That's why he can do the things he do because he is that. So whenever, instead of fighting this force, he realized the only way to get rid of this force, um, this opposing force encompassed by Agent Smith, and remember, opposing force is the meaning of Satan, right? So just this opposing force, whenever he stops reacting to that force, surrendering to it in a way, then that force lost power because it had nothing to push against. And then when Neo died, he truly became part of the whole because now he's not encompassed in his body anymore. Now his spirit has joined His soul has joined the collective spirit. So all that light that he was carrying got added to the collective. And that is what saved the world. Basically, his own enlightenment brought up the entire world. It helped enlighten the world in this time of darkness. And as always, it always comes down to love, true caring, true generosity, truly seeing everybody as one family. And not just everybody, but everything even. Sacrifice your own ego, your own selfishness for the greater good. That's the lesson here, and that's the lesson of all superheroes. Because if they could... They could easily use their own power just for their own selfish gain. Which you you need to take care of yourself to a certain level. But then past that level, it's, it's more about than just getting what you need. Now it's more about feelings of your ego feeling greater. Like, like you're a bigger ego than others. You're more powerful. 
which is only an illusion because why at the deepest sense, the truest power is that eternal, whatever you want to call it. Right here, I'll say that eternal, grand, great, infinite spirit. 